Okay, so we've come back to my hometown of Dublin to the Science Gallery because they have an exhibit on at the minute about the elements. And the reason I am particularly interested is that they've got a big bunch of periodic tables. As you know, we love periodic tables. So we're gonna go in and see what these tables look like. Okay, so we've got here a periodic table in Braille, which is actually, I think, pretty cool. This is hydrogen. <laughs> After that, uh, this is the rest of the elements. <laughs> I don't read Braille at all. This is, I like this one, I do like this one. This is a periodic table, but it's laid out like a sight test chart. Um, I've seen lots of these in my time because I'm a poor eyesight, so I've read lots of sight tests. But it's really good, it gets really small down here. Go stand back there. <coughs> What's that one? Technetium. What's that one? No, can't see that. So what this does is, it's weighing me, and then it takes the average um, amount of different elements in a person, and it's gonna tell me how many atoms of each element are actually in my body. Okay, so the highlights. I'm mostly oxygen, 41.925 kilos of oxygen. And I've got 1.58 by 10 to the 27 atoms of oxygen in my body. It's a long list. We've got radium. We've got 6.5 by 10 to the minus 20-ish <laughs> grams of radium. We've got 1.7 by 10 to the 7 atoms. So still more than a million atoms. So that's me. That's what it takes to make me. So this is a really nice representation of the periodic table. If you look back, you can actually see the shape of it. And what it's made out of are different heating elements. So it's actually made of elements. In this case, heating elements. Um, I worked that out as soon as I saw it. Brady didn't. Um, Brady's a little bit slow. Um, <laughs> but it's nice, isn't it? I don't like the fact that they're all the same material. As we know, the periodic table is obviously made of different elements. These appear to be all pretty similar heating elements. But I like the shape of it. <laughs> it's called I don't think you understand the way I feel about the stove. <laughs> I really like this. What we've got here is, we've got an exhibit on the periodic table, and what the organizers have done is, they've asked members of the public to bring in samples of different elements. Um, so it started off empty with just these boxes, labeled with different elements. I'm gonna look at some of my favorite ones. Uh, I'm gonna go over here, I really like this one. We've got here, somebody brought in some radium blades, double-edged blades for shaving with radium. So years ago, people thought radium was the cure for everything, and they put it into uh, products such as toothpaste and things like that. Whether or not these blades have any radium or that's the trademark, I don't know. What have we got here? We've got a, a sodium salt. We know what that is. We have a joke about sodium somebody brought in. I like this one. Heard any good sodium jokes lately? Nah. These are moldy looking bananas. This is pretty cool actually. In the titanium exhibit, somebody brought in an x-ray of their leg showing titanium pins, where it's this, which are stitching their broken leg together. I like that. We've got an old iron, an actual iron iron, which is pretty cool. Selenium, Brazil nuts, good source of selenium apparently. So what we're going to do is, we're going to make an addition to this periodic table. And I actually like these elements down here. All of these boxes, potassium, magnesium, stadium, these are all empty. So what I'm going to add is a card which shows the professor and Brady in Darmstadt at the laboratory where they actually made Darmstadium. The reason that I want to add this one is Darmstadium is a quite obviously quite a rare element and I doubt if any member of the public is going to be able to bring a sample along to put into the exhibit. So this card is probably the closest we can get anyway. So I have I've written my name, the element is Darm Stadium. And this is a photo showing Professor Polyakov at the GSI Darmstadt where Darm Stadium was isolated. Okay. So there we go. So we've added to the periodic table.